Hello there, this is Sufi from Get Data Solution. Today we'll see about sales. We'll see three amazing sales charts. The first one is sales comparison of a single salesman versus average of all. Here is the data, the green one with the broken line is the average sales of all salesperson and this the blue one is for this particular guy in this case abdisa this will be dynamically change can you see it if you also select branch it will automatically change so this is one of the topic of for today the second is about sales percentage and change over the previous months here is a sales percent for january and february then this is the percentage change compared to the previous months both in percentage and in uh, icon showing uh, positive change and negative change positive change is actually in green and uh, it decreases in red icon so we'll see that also with different uh, items and the branch that's the second topic and the third topic will be the third topic will be sales filter where we see the performance of sales by months and by branch and sales by month will be displayed like this and also we'll have sales by branch so we'll see all this uh, sales performance so just before coming to the detail let's come to the, the this channel which is get data solution this channel get data solution provide dashboard and other data management tools and the purpose of this channel is to modernize data system to save time to generate automatic report to reduce cost to increase productivity to manage projects to manage business and to learn new skills so at the end of this today's topic we'll try to assess uh, uh, the validity of all this purpose in relation to today's topic if you are actually new to this channel please consider subscribing to this channel here is the reason why you should subscribe to our channel the first one it will help you to manage your business if you are actually a business uh, person it also actually help you to manage your project if you are actually working on project to manage your work whether you are actually engaged in any work it will actually help you to manage your work the other is it will automate automate your activity so uh, it will automate your activity hence it also uh, increase your productivity since it automate your activity it will increase your productivity as well the other is it will help you to learn new skills if you learn news if you just tune into this channel you learn new skills that you can actually easily learn and practice and uh, use for your uh, work and business the other is it will actually help you to make informed decision based on the results of the data it will actually uh, make you uh, to make informed decision based on the result so those are the reasons why you should subscribe for this channel so coming to our data today here is the data entry page where we have a physical year a branch months date item quantity sold unit price total price and employee for this data we use uh, 
this items we have selected electronics with their unit price already set here here is the laptop computer with 30,000 desktop computer 40,000 and so on here is the items we are actually engaged and assuming the price is this one and we have here four branches Adama, Finfine, Shashamane and Batu and we have sales persons here at different uh, brands, for example, in Adama, Abdisa, Adam, and Amane. Here in Fimfine, we have these guys, and in Sheshamane, these guys, and in Batu, these guys. So, uh, all together, we have uh, this 14 uh, salesmen in four branches, and here we have five products. To be sold so this is the basis for our uh, data then we'll insert the data here the first one is a physical view where we simply uh, select from drop down menu and currently we have used 2021 and here is also the branch will be actually selected from uh, drop down menu and we select the branch then the month will be also selected from uh, drop down menu. The date will write the date. Uh, item is also selected from drop down menu. We select, and the main input for us is the quantity sold. We simply write the quantity sold, and then the unit price will automatically. Uh, uh, populated from Viluka function where we have taken this uh, data from the system so the unit price is automatically uh, uh, populated once we have selected the item if for example this is the current laptop if I make camera can you see it will actually change so uh, So it will also automatically calculate the total price where the total price is quantity sold times unit price. Then the employee who have actually uh, sold this item will select that guy from the drop down list. That's it. This is the input in most of the cases. Uh, we use the drop down for the first three, we use drop down. Here we write, here we use drop down, and this is our main entry of the data where we insert the quantity sold. Then this will, uh, this will be actually uh, automatically populated, and here is also uh, the employee who have actually, the salesman will be actually selected from the drop down list. So that is our input, and for that we have also instruction here how to insert into the data system. So, once we have actually insert this data, uh, we'll have the output in terms of uh, the chart I've already shown here, this one, and this one, and this one. So, let's come to discuss detail of it. So, once we have actually make our uh, data field, we have to update the data and refresh it. Then we'll go see the performance of uh, our cells. Let's look from, let's start from this one, which is sales comparison of single salesman versus all. At the moment, we have actually, uh, let's select this one. Here is all branches are selected and the salesman Abdisa is selected. And here is the average performance of sales for all salesmen in green, broken line, broken line. 
and this is the performance of Abdisa. Abdisa's performance, as you can see, for the first two months, January and February, is below the average of all staff or all salesmen. Rent has actually grown above up to this point, up to May, then decline, then increase. So let's look for the other guy, which is Adam, for example. Oh, Adam performance is good up to this point, up to May, then decline, then increased. Let's look for the other guy again here. For Barite, uh, the performance is good up to this point, up to March, then declined, then raised again. So we can also look into the performance of branch this is Adama is selected for example we have uh, three guys in Adama Abdisa, Adam and Damani let's look uh, Abdisa's performance compared to Adama's average here is Atlas seems like it is performing well close sometimes above sometimes just close to the average of Adama's performance overall so uh, it looks like uh, bell shape for Adam oh this is very mix mixed for January uh, to February and March is good then decline then increase for Amani for example yeah it's somehow good up to this point then decline then again so let's look for Infine. here we have Infine. we have four staffs let's say for Moti or oh, Moti's performance is yeah, above the average of, for yeah, up to March then decline in April then in, increased let's let's look for Moti's performance for the whole Oh, it looks like this one. Let's look for Batu again. Bonus performance compared to the average of Batu's average. Oh, it has been actually uh, below the average for some part of the month and then then proportional to average or somewhat equal to average Let, let's look for Shashamane for Gamada for this for example oh he's actually performing pretty good up to this point then declined here Godana oh is actually performing not performing very well for some of the months then and then increased then decreased so this is a very interactive uh, chart that shows sales comparison of a single salesman versus all uh, sales persons average so that is a good performance indicator for uh, both in terms of the branch as well as uh, individual person performance Let's come to the second chart. The second chart shows us uh, the sales and sales percentage and the change over the previous months compared to the previous months. For example, in this particular case, for January, it is 11.3 uh, million. For February, it's 31.6 million. So the percentage change is 178, which is since it is actually positive this is indicated by icon green icon um, showing upward direction it's a good indicator uh, for april is downward direction is negative again here so in terms of performance for compared to the previous months at, at least for 
from August to December is a good performance, but here it has declined. So this can be actually, uh, we can see it for branch, for example, if we select Adama, uh, Adama's performance is in good in February and March, which is upward direction and downward direction for April and May. Let's look again for Shashamane. Shashamane's performance is also, as you can see here, compared to January in February, is upward then downward then upward. So we can also select a particular item, let's say camera, the performance of sales of camera. In January, it is sold 1.4 million. In February, 6.1 million, which is 323%. This is an upward direction. Then, for three consecutive months, January, I mean March, April, and May, it has declined here. Let's look for other items. Let's say for desktop computer. Oh, it is also mixed. Some up, some downs. Laptop computer. Oh, this is also mixed. Uh, performance in February is uh, just showing an increment. Then it has declined for consecutive three months: March, April, and May. Then it has actually uh, show a progressive increment from August to December. So we can also look for other products as well. We can, at the same time, we can also see for, for a single branch and a single item. For example, in this case, Adama and only camera, the performance is uh, as you can see, it is mixed it for February compared to January, it is upward, then upward, then downward, then downward. So this is a good indicator of our performance in sales. So this is also a very uh, good indicator for our sales performance. Let's come to the other chart, which is sales filter. Here we have a sales filter by month and by branch. This is a performance of individual items in terms of the sales. Here is laptop computer, 32 million. This is 32.7, 20.5, 25.8, 29.3, .8, and overall performance for all items is 140.5 million. In terms of the performance here that is also shown here in distribution by months can also hear sales by branch here in Adama over 44.9 million Pimfinne 38.7 million Shashamane 25.3 million Batu 31.5 million so we can see the performance both in branch and by months so what is very interesting is, we, since it's a sales filter, we can filter the month as well as the branch. Let's look how it works. Currently, here we have over 140 million for all months and for all branch. Let's filter for the month of January only. We select here for month of January. Here the performance is uh, 100. 11.3 million it is the performance of individual items we can also select two months if you like for example january and february is selected this it shows multiple items selected here is shows 42.9 million we can at the same time select uh, a branch that we actually need to see let's say so let's select only Adama Adama is selected in this case the performance of Adama is 44.98 
1.4985,000 it should be coincide with this chart yeah it is similar to that one so um, this is the individual performance of sales in a drama branch we can uh, select another branch for example let's select that of Shashamane Shashamane's performance is 5.3 million it must show this yeah it is similar here so we can actually filter our sales performance based on our need we can uh, see the performance by by months we can select any months of our interest or even multiple uh, months then we can select um, uh, select any branch and see the performance of individual atoms sales performance so uh, this is very important for uh, salesperson here is uh, some of the benefit of this system the first benefit is it easy and convenient to enter the data and in this case and add sales as I've already seen here the main input is a quantity sold here quantity sold here and others will be just selected from drop down menus the other benefit is it automatically updates sales and then it automatically generates chart and achievement as you have already seen here in both the, this chart which is dynamically change comparison of sales person's performance against the average uh, comparison of current month's performance against previous months and sales filter here so it is automatically generates sales chart and achievement save time and avoid manual calculation it's simple to view by month or by branch it's convenient to share to teams sales person sales manager it's also good uh, help us to support uh, follow-up of our sales performance let the team or the branch to show to know sales progress as a team was as a branch for example it also helps to keep data quality as well as view percentage change from previous month including by branch and by atom so this is it has multi benefits as we have actually already uh, discussed and therefore this is recommended for the following the first one is for sales managers and sales team and sales persons for business organization where we ha where they have different branches and different sales persons so that is also uh, recommendable for business organizations which are actually engaged in sales for book sellers stationary owners small business owners sales branch offices and sales branch managers can use this system where uh, they can actually have a very dynamic changing sales performance uh, as i've already said here uh, showing different uh, performance compared to uh, by sales person comparison against all or to know the sales performance compared to the previous months or to see the performance by filtering for each atom and for each branch so that is it and i think we have actually seen a lot of things and earlier we have claimed that uh, uh, this system will have 
the following purpose uh, at least in today's topic we have tried to uh, realize some of the purpose of our claims for example in terms of saving time this uh, actually save time for example we have actually uh, reduced the time of entering the data into this system some of them are uh, used from peak list and the only quantity uh, quantity is actually the only input we have actually insert manually uh, so that is uh, save time generate automatic report as you have seen we have automatically uh, produced three reports reduce costs yeah it can also reduce in terms of uh, we can simply use this excel chart and uh, track our progress rather than paying for advanced uh, tools buying uh, in, instead of buying advanced tools yeah it is also uh, somehow increase our productivity we simply input uh, some data and then uh, easily updates and generate our chart so we can actually uh, use the, the remaining time for our other purposes so uh, it's also help us to manage business so in today's topic some of uh, this um, purpose have been realized at least in seeing this topic and even to modernize the data system so this will actually make our modernizing our sales uh, system so with that uh, thank you very much and if you like this video please consider subscribing and share to your uh, people in your circle and thank you once again and bye bye